Tema Hosni is the only singer in the Middle East whose concerts are attended by close to half a million fans. In 2010, Jermaine Jackson came all the way to London to present the African Music Award to Tema in appreciation of his artistic contribution to music and the Middle East. This year winner is Tema Hosni. Tema Hosni has achieved many awards both regionally and globally. He received a special award from Big Apple in New York in 2010 for being a multi-talented artist. Tema concentrates his efforts constantly towards his people's problems and charitable events. The Arab Student Association in St. John's University in New York awarded Tema Hosni with a special award for his achievements. God has a plan for all of us and will reward us with more than what we can expect. Most of his songs call for peace and harmony in the world for every race and creed. Thank you, Tamar Posti, for coming to support us. I appreciate we all appreciate it. All the team from Operation Smile wants to thank you from the bottom of their hearts for your kindness and for your generosity. Tamar, you're the best. Operation Smile loves you. The doctors and the nurses from the United States and around the world love you. Come on back. Help us again. We want to hear some songs from you. You rock! The legendary music producer Quincy Jones has collaborated with the Grammy-winning producer Red One to jointly produce the Arabic charity single entitled Tomorrow, Bukra. Tamar Hosni. Tamar Hosni is my little brother and he's on his way to go all the way. Watch the scene. It's an, uh... He's a legend, a young legend. I love him. Uh, super talented, and he's a role model for all Arabic artists. And they have chosen Tema Hosni as the only Egyptian male singer to collaborate with singers from 16 nations, including superstar Akon and Shakira. We'll go to benefit and support children's education in arts, music, and culture. And Bokra, which means tomorrow, the talented Quincy Jones and Bathers Partnership. In 2011, Tema Hosni's YouTube channel was created to gather millions of views from all over the world. After only two years, it achieved more than 100 million views to take first place as the most viewed channel in the Middle East. In his last TV series, his target was to unite Muslims and Christians in society and achieve the highest viewer rate. Tamar is considered number one in the Arab box office and he is adored for his comic movies in the Middle East. Tema Hosni has released till now nine successful music albums. His latest album in 2013, Bahabak Enter, achieved the best sales in the Middle East and also took first place in online music downloads. People love him for the romantic words which touch the tender hearts of the Arab people. With his handsome heart-shaped face, he is adored by Middle Eastern women. Tamer is one of the few artists in the world who writes and composes most of his songs. He also writes a script for his movies and encourages new talent in singing and acting. He was the first to change the face of musicals in the Middle East. He synchronizes his musicals with special effects. In 2007 and 2008, 
Tamer began a promotion for one of the biggest cell phone companies in the world, Vodafone. He has signed deals to represent two of the world's biggest companies in the Middle East, Pepsi and Police. Era facile, dopo George Clooney, Bruce Willis, David Beckham, Antonio Banderas, trovare un nostro destino. In fact, he became the first Arab artist to promote for police. In 2012, Tema Hosni started collaborating in many international music projects with the most popular international singers in the world. Oh, Snoop! Habibi, Tama. Habibi, Albi. Habibi. I love you too, but loving Tama, that's my brother. Tama, the man. Middle East, they got the whole place locked. You know how it go, yeah. Hey man, how's me and with Shaggy, and it's crazy. Trust me, when you hear it in the club, you, you're you gonna dance. Tama fans, y'all know I love y'all. Just a big Snoop Dogg, man. Get the record, y'all know what it is. Here we go, here we go. Media and newspapers consider him exciting material and often the stories are exaggerated or untrue, simply to cause sensation. Despite the sometimes destructive media coverage, he is still considered honourable and of great value to his country. This is Tamar